YouTube, 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 never fear, Logan Jay's here, back with another sneaker review. Today I bring you a pickup that I ordered around Thanksgiving, it's finally showing up, and uh, so, uh, yeah, it, it, it took a, a while, and they just finally popped up on the website, actually today, and uh, yeah, I, I'm guessing... A lot of people um, really weren't after these as much as the salmon toes. There's not a big demand, and uh, but yeah, I'm happy to have them, and I'll let you know how I feel uh, more on the sneaker when I'm doing the review. First off, you got this box that I love. I love a special box. Man, look at this. This is fire. You got your Asics logo there a6 kit you know you got teal blacks grays you know got that branding going throughout i love it you got your tag here gel light five castle rock and black I'm guessing that's what they're calling the teal you got your quality control stickers over here You have this dust bag it comes with, like a sale dust bag. Has A6 and KISS 10 year anniversary. You got your regular tissue paper here. And that's about it. It also comes with a little pen. You can see that. You can barely see on the underlays here. Um, the teal uh, I'm guessing it's kind of hard to do the pin like that but that's as good as it's gonna get there you got your extra set of gray laces teal flat laces black and teal laces these are fire rope laces and the black laces that already come in here and here they are. Woo! -hoo -hoo! Yes, got the leather backs. Yes. Finally. After 10 years. Finally. Woo! Uh, one thing I'm gonna point out is uh look at look at what's going on on the heel. Let's see if I line them up pretty good there. And you see how off that is? See how this is going up? This is more lower. That cut is horrible. Man. They did a horrible job with these. Uh, not going to be returning them. I'm keeping them. I want them. It is what it is. But just letting you know. Um, craftsmanship. Quality control. It's not all that. <clears throat> so. what? Uh, I started off with the also. You got your teal hits. Here. And in the heel, you got your A6 branding right there in the black middle portion. You got a blacked out midsole. Use this one, blacked out midsole. You got a little A6 branding right there. Get you up close, look at that. From the midsole to the upper, got a lot of Woo stains going on, man. Just not that good, man. Look at that. Just not good. And uh, on the toe box area, you got this gray new buck that's a little lighter than what's on the toe box here with your perforations there. And this feels like a pigskin suede and has little backstroke. Don't know if you'll be able to see it on camera, but it is there. It's it's got good quality. Even though it's only this little bit, they did throw in good quality. And the leather as well. The whole leather back 
portion of the sneaker. It is good, good leather. You got your Kith branding right there with your X for the 10 year anniversary. And you can see how bad that cut is. Look at that, just it's really off. And you got your ASICS branding with that teal underneath, just popping off, black laces. You got your neoprene sock liner going on. On this one, it says FIG up top. And this one, it says ASICS. So yeah, you got your Gel Light 5 branding going on right there. As I said, black sock liner. Insole is black. You got your ASICS and Kith branding in that teal. 10 year anniversary. And that's a sneaker. It is a fire sneaker. Um, I know a lot of people not into uh, a lot of ASICS and stuff, you know, and or in the same vein as um, New Balance and stuff. And right now, um, is this a need? Nah, I wouldn't say it's a need um, for somebody's collection. Only for people that have really been wanting it. That That's the only thing, you know what I'm saying? That's what uh, made me want this sneaker. Um, if you ain't feel any type of thing, any nostalgia, anything that wanting that Gel Light 3, you probably ain't going to be wanting this one. Uh, that's all I'm going to say so um, I think more people do like the salmon toes um, compared to this colorway even though they're both fire colorways but again as I said this sneaker right here you know um, the way it's done I would uh, say yeah now nah, pass because um, uh yeah it ain't that good um i did see some glue stains in the um salmon toes um you know i haven't really watched anybody's uh video on um both gel like fives so but um but yeah as far as these again just cop if you really like them and they're still available they're on kith so um check it out on kith today um what's today uh the fifth and um yeah just uh see if um you're interested in whatnot sizing i would go up half sizing because i did try on the uh, the salmon toes thinking these fit the same i went with the 12 Normally, I'm a size 11. I can go um, an 11 and a half. I have an 11 and a half in a gel like five, but when I went with the 12 on a different pair of a gel like five, they fit good, perfect. I went the salmon toes, I went with the 12, and then one was feeling a little loose. So, I'm thinking these you could go um, half size up from your normal size. I would suggest going up half size you don't need to go full size up now um, the pair that i have that's an 11 and a half it um it just feels really snug would i um have liked to go up uh, full size from where i'm um, another half size up from where i am yeah but it's still like uh wearable so if you like that true to size size fit like really 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 snug I say go up half size um, but is the sneaker flopping around no it's not flopping around but it doesn't fit as snug as it should be and over time you know when you wear it in they're gonna get a little looser so but um but yeah um, that's the only thing uh, I wish I would half size up but I didn't know so hopefully you know you uh, pay attention and listen to um, the sizing issue with these um, just go up half size up if you're looking for a gel light 5 same thing I do with the gel light 3's I go up a whole size to a size 12 and I would do the same thing with unless I really 
um, I, I've gotten a pair of used uh, Gel A3s and I go to, I've gone to an 11 and a half. So, you know, is it possible? Yeah, but I just like that fit. So, but, um, but yeah, again, just go up half size from your normal size. That's it. You'll be fine. It ain't gonna kill you. All right, YouTube. It's your boy Logan J. I hope you enjoyed the review. I'm signing out. Yeah. Can't believe I got these. YouTube. Peace.